Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The world has already witnessed the widespread use of Turkey's Bayraktar TB2 drones in recent conflict between Armenia and Azerbaijan and Russia and Ukraine ongoing conflicts. While the effectiveness of US is debatable, it was able to market itself pretty well in global arms market especially with the countries having smaller military budget riding on the success of tb2 on 28th july 2021 turkey unveiled the first design images and information about the characteristics of kizilema ucav now as per latest update the first automatic taxi and running test of bayraktar kizilema was successfully completed the first flight of ucav is planned in the year 2023 Bayraktar has shown commendable pace of development especially in the UCAV area and it is not the first time Akini the hail UCAV by Bayraktar took its first flight in 2019 and entered into service in the year 2021 Bayraktar Kizlema is going to be a jet powered single engine carrier capable unmanned fighter UCAV similar to HL's Cats Warrior UCAV program under development The Bayraktar Kizlema is going to be a low observable UCAV powered by turbofan engine and fed by two air inlets. The aircraft has delta wing and canard configuration having small four wings that is canards mounted forward on the main wings which are triangular in shape. The overall geometry of the airframe is consistent with contemporary stealth aircraft design with minimum protrusions. and body angles seemingly optimized for decreasing the radar cross section the ucav will also have radar absorbing material coating for improved stealth characteristics the coupled canard controls have been given for the increased maneuverability and better controlling the main wing airflow the ucav also features an internal weapons bay which will allow the aircraft to operate in contested environments while sustaining low observability it will have take off and landing capability from short runways and aircraft carriers the ucav will be able to operate in line of sight and beyond line of sight of ground control station it can be launched and retrieved from aircraft carrier or helicopter carriers it will feature a retractable tricycle landing gear and for deck operation a tail hook and possibly a folding wing main planes For talking about its performance characteristic the UCAV will have an operational radius of 930 km operational altitude of 35000 ft with endurance of 5 to 6 hours the maximum takeoff weight of UCAV is 6 tons with cruise speed of 0.6 mac and maximum speed of 0.9 mac its payload capacity is 1500 kg where it can carry air to air missiles air to surface and to ship missiles guided and unguided bombs and anti radiation missiles it will also be able to carry miniaturized electronic warfare payload acting as a stand in jammer and suppress the enemy air defenses to significantly increase the aircraft survivability the ucav will have an aes radar for enhanced situational awareness this was today's update Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and jai hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.